Welcome, my name is Dre Kai, and let's play Crusader Kings 2 Holy Fury Rise of the Von Habsburgs. This will be my first let's play. I have over a thousand hours into the game. It's probably one of my favorite games of all time. And I thought, what the hell? Let's make a let's play. Our goals are going to be to see if we can make the Von Habsburgs, maybe the Emperor of the Holy Roman Empire early, or possibly take over a Crusader uh, Kingdom. Uh, we'll see what happens. Alright, let's see these delayed dynamics. Uh, let's do dynamic. Um, I don't like the Aztec invasion. We're going to turn that off. These events. All right. Let's see here, we are a patient, chaste, charitable, arbitrary, tough soldier. We have a wife already, Count Regine Lind. We are Count Werner of Basil. I'm not sure why they changed it to Basil, it used to be Arju. But, you know, map changes. We have one son already, Otto von Habsburg. He's six years old. Let's go with duty for him. Giving you conscientious, which is one of the best things to start out with. You can either get diligent or temperate. Both amazing traits. We also have a daughter, Ida von Habsburg, who is two years old. Character focus. We are going to go with hunting. And let's see here. We could create a treasury, make a friend, become a paragon of virtue. King of Bulgaria, acquire title, become chancellor, build a war chest, or groom an heir. Well, we already have an heir, so we don't really need another one yet. Um, let's say make a friend. We are also going to join hmm, the Benedictine or the Dominican order. I think we'll go with the Benedictines. We're going to be a holy person. Let's see here, minor titles. I usually like to go with Stuarts, High Stuarts, to be my designated regent. Ruperch. Alright. Court physician. Franz, you're good. What else do we have here? We could search for a smith, but we don't really have the money yet. So, let's start this up! Currently, our liege is Kaiser Henrik IV of the Holy Roman Empire. Directly under the Kaiser. Alright. The du jour duchy that we are part of. Transgerania. If I'm mispronouncing anything, I apologize to anyone who actually lives in these countries. 
I am horrible at speaking. Let's go here. For levies, we've got about 550 troops. Title revoke. Lords of the Holy Roman Empire have approved the institution of Tito Relo Revocation Allowed Law. Alright. That's alright for now. Anything we can do here? No, not really. Thing I don't like about being in the Benedictine order is you can't change your hairstyle or beard or anything you're just stuck looking like a monk all right our liege has declared holy Roman French de jour war over Zealand on King Philip of France let's see that is up here all right We're not going to worry too much about that right now. We don't really, you know, it's a little above our pay grade. Their stats aren't too bad. 10, 11, 4, 8, 0. 0 learning is kind of, you know, not great. Personal combat skill. 12, alright. Not much we can really do here yet. We've got to get some money together. You know, so we can start building things. Eventually we want to take over our du jour county. Wouldn't mind making our way over here either because now... Uh, well, you can form the Archduchy of Austria, which is where the Von Habsburgs eventually went. Your wife, Countess Regine Lind, has sent you a gift. It is a small puppy, but of the finest pedigree, and destined to grow into a great hunting dog. Yes, I will accept this gracious gift. It gives me one health more, one diplomacy. Hmm, let's call him Tricky. Our leech doesn't like us that much. Let's, uh, let's try to sway him to like us more. We do have a sister who is married to the Count of Bern, which is right next to where we are. Alright. Wonder, would you like to form an alliance? Yes, you would. I wonder if there's anyone good for our son to marry. Look, age-wise, he is only seven, so we don't want anything to... Badenburg, which is oh, let's let's do this. Range patrol. It's auto. Let's see about our daughter. Duke of Holland. 
Yeah, they're in our realm. Not too much older than her. Do that. to the Honorable Count Werner. Blessing upon you and your house. I have decided to, to accept your suggestion of a betrothal between Otto and Edelhead. I, I'm not sure, but yeah, we'll go with that. Edelhead. Kaiser Henrik IV of the Holy, Rolling, Holy Roman Empire has created the Duchy of Dolphine. To the chase, Count Werner. May you live in harmony and contentment. I have decided to accept your suggestion of betrothal between Ida and Duke Dirk V. Alright. Now, let's see here. Would you like an alliance? No. Alright. Would you like an alliance? Yes, you would. The magnificent Count Werner. Blessings upon you and your house. I, Duke Ernest of Austria, accept your proposal for an alliance. dog is growing quickly and is no longer a little puppy. He runs fast and has a keen nose, and your dog handlers praise his good character. Good dog. Good dog indeed. Perhaps it is time I ask Kaiser Henrik IV to spend some time with me. It is probably the fastest way to gain his trust. I will ask him. Henrik was happy to oblige me. Now that I have some time to spend with him, I am confident that I can convince him of how alike we are, and that he stands only to gain from our friendship. We can finally talk in private. I think these days have really helped me getting Henrik to know and appreciate me better. We have passed most of our time in my palace discussing of the most disparate topics. Please allow me to give you something before leaving because of charitable. That would give him plus ten. He's softened. Let's see what else here. Surely you appreciate having such a liberal host because we're arbitrary. That gives us ten. Hope you like it. We're going to go with charitable. Makes this a little bit more. Hmm, I kind of want to take this from this guy. I think we are going to... Ooh. Hmm. It's pretty horrible. Oh, but he's not that... Uh. Well, it's not going to be much of a chance of this to happen. I can't really get rid of him because he's powerful. And Franz is just way too good at 22 to replace him with. 
forgot to go through all of this stuff before. We're going to train troops. Collect taxes. We're going to study technology. I always like to study technology in the Byzantine Empire because, well, they usually have the best. And, um... We are going to improve religious relations with the Pope. Because you can always, you always, always want the Pope to like you more. At least if you're Catholic. Hmm, that's a pretty good Pope. You notice there, the Pope and his heir, those are the new Italian portraits. There's also some new French ones you can check out here. But alright. Henrik has set up Pope Ooh! Our liege just set up an anti-pope. Not sure that's a good idea. You know, that just wrecked our moral authority. We just get negative 30 because of the anti-pope. We have any saints yet? No, no saints. College of Cardinals. You know, we don't have much money, but I think it would be a good idea. Search for Smith and get some jewelry made gives us some bonuses to our vassals, which we don't have many of it right now, but, you know, it's always good to start that early. Yeah, our liege was crowned by the Pope, and yet he doesn't like the Pope. Uh, interesting. Interesting indeed. Kaiser Henrik IV of the Holy Roman Empire has created the Duchy of Transgerania. That's... That's where we are. I wonder who he'll give it to, or if he'll keep it for himself. Might keep it for himself because, well, he only has two. Nope. Oh, he gave it to. To Drod. During the last few days, I have overheard the same conversation again and again. Apparently, a most renowned goldsmith is traveling through Basil, and my courtiers are prattling excitedly about his work. Perhaps I should invite this man and employ his services. Nothing displays authority like fine jewelry. The goldsmith Wilhelm courteously accepted my invitation and arrived at court a mere week later. He has presented me with some sketches of his previous work and several letters of recommendation. I am assured of his skill, although I ask myself just how much money I can spare for a set of crown jewels. Order a beautiful set of crown jewels. Well, we'll lose 50 gold, but we will get some things from that. Now, this is interesting because the person who the Kaiser gave the Dutchful title to is not de jure part of that duchy. He's part of Savoy. So, huh, he doesn't like me. 
then I have to sway him now instead of the Kaiser, which, you know, a liege is greedy, lustful, patient, and ambitious. Hmm. God's blessing upon the Donatus Werner. Bring the truth, faith, and salvation to others is among the holiest of duty. Therefore, we ask you to construct a new church in your lands so your subjects may have somewhere to say prayers and worship. Go with God, sign Conversus Stigand. Alright, you know, it'll be a while. We, you know, only have 23 gold, and I'm pretty sure that, yeah, a new building would be well, almost 700. I've decided to take Otto along with me today as I preach to the people about God and how they should try to live their lives according to the rule of St. Benedict. Otto is attentive throughout, and I am sure he has learnt some valuable lessons about God and the Benedictine order today. He is an excellent student. Ooh, let's see if he gains anything. You know? Looks like he gained one martial and one learning. Very nice. Ooh, Holy Roman Cathar Revolt for the Duchy of Milan. A heavy box has been brought before me. Wilhelm has finished his work and the crown jewels are complete. I expected something properly befitting my title as Count of Vizale, and I am excited to see his handiwork. Let's see what he gave us. So, we got... Crown of Lilies. 0.10% prestige, plus one with all the vassals, noble scepter, alright, and grave sword, very nice. It should help. But you know what? That's where we're going to end it here today. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed yourself, please like and subscribe to help the channel grow. As this was my first Let's Play, it has just barely started. But, I'll see you again soon.